welcome to session 5. Now in this session, we will focus on refinement of the asanas that we have done in the previous sessions. And when I say refinement, I mean alignment of the spine. Let's get set and begin with the warm up. Squat. Instructions first and then we do this together. Keep your feet hip width apart, arms extended out in front nice and straight, hips back and down and go low. Ensure your knee does not go ahead of the toes. Weight on the heel, back straight, chest upright. So inhale on top, exhale down. We're going to do this together for five repetitions. Are we ready? Let's go. Inhale, exhale down. Inhale, exhale down. Feel those quad muscles, hamstrings, glutes all getting engaged including your back come on last one and done forward and backward bend instructions first and then we do this together keep your feet comfortably apart arms together now inhale a slight arch exhale go down hinge at the hips chest and then your head keep your knees soft now inhale up, head first and then chest and then hips, exhale and down. Keep your knees soft. Let's do this together, five repetitions. Are we ready? And go, inhale up, arch your back, exhale down, soft knees, inhale up, exhale down. Opening up the hip flexors. Inhale up. Exhale. This one warms up the entire body. Two more reps. Last one. And done. Warrior 1 to a reverse warrior. Instructions first and then we do this together. Down to the mountain pose. Now from here bring your right foot between your arms. Head up, chest up, arms up to the ceiling. This is your warrior 1. And we hold this for 5 breaths. From here to the reverse warrior. Drop your right arm all the way back. Grabbing your left thigh from the outside. Now push your hips out, arch your back, push your left arm up to the ceiling and bend. Your back leg extended and we hold this for five breaths. And then we repeat on the other side. Are we ready? Let's do this together. Starting with the mountain pose. Right foot between your arms. Head up, chest up, and arms all the way up to the ceiling. Keep that spine straight. Five breaths. Back leg extended out. Keep your knee locked. One more breath. Inhale and exhale. Now from here, reverse warrior, drop your right arm down all the way at the back, left arm all the way up to the ceiling and backward bend, hold for five breaths. Back leg straight, two more. And bring your arms down, right leg back, hold that mountain, left leg between your arms, head up, chest up, spine straight and arms all the way up to the ceiling. Hold five breaths. Back leg fully extended, knee locked. Hip flexors, 
working all over again. Two more deep breaths. And reverse warrior. Drop your left arm all the way down, grabbing your right thigh. Now, push your right arm up to the ceiling, backward bend and hold. Five breaths. Back leg extended. One more deep breath. Come on, stay with me. And down. Bring your arms down. Push your left leg out and back. Mountain. And gently rise up. And down. Squat to forward bend. Instructions first and then we do this together. Now keep your feet hip width apart, interlock your fingers, down in a squat, we've done this in the warm up, you don't need to go too low, ensure your chest is upright and back straight. Now push those hands up, keep it interlocked towards the ceiling and we hold this for five breaths, chest upright, back straight. From here we inhale, arch up, exhale all the way down, grab your ankle, from the outside now chin up inhale exhale down shoulders relax elbows soft and we hold that again for five breaths and we repeat that one more time are we ready let's do this together first one is a squat interlock your fingers now down hinge at the hips weight on the heel don't go too low the idea is to keep your chest up and back straight and work that upper body Arms up towards the ceiling and five breaths. You'll feel your neck, your shoulders, your chest and back really work. Feel the quads burn but you don't need to go too low. Two more deep breaths. Open up the chest. Now from here, inhale up, arch, exhale down. Grab your ankle from the outside. Now chin up, inhale, exhale, go further down. Five breaths here. Relax your shoulders, your elbows. Feel your core completely engaged. can keep your knees soft hold down two more deep breaths last one and gently rise up interlock your fingers and down to the squat arms all the way up to the ceiling five breaths chest upright back straight three more deep breaths Doing good. One more. And rise up, arch, inhale, exhale, down. Grab the ankle, chin up, inhale, exhale, down. Head down, soft knees, five breaths. Stay with me. Relax those shoulders, relax your elbows, engage the core. One last deep breath. And gently rise up. And down. Seated single leg forward bend and a reverse plank. Instructions first and then we do this together. Down on the floor, legs extended out, nice and straight. Now, bend your left knee, bring your left foot very close to your right inner thigh. Now, take a deep breath. Inhale, exhale and reach forward for your right foot. Grip your foot and chest down. Eyes on the big toe and we hold that for five breaths. From here, we drop our left arm down at the back close to your butt. 
lift those hips up off the ground and right arm all the way to the back eyes following your fingers your right finger hold and five breaths there and then we repeat on the other side are we ready let's do this together right leg out extended left knee bent take a deep breath inhale exhale reach out and grab your right foot inhale chin up exhale go further down and gaze at your right toe and five breaths chest down three more deep breaths last one and gently rise up bring your left arm to the back close to your butt hips off the ground and right arm all the way back and eyes following the right hand five breaths your abdomen hip flexors opening up two more deep breaths and gently drop down now extend your left leg out bend your right knee bring your right foot close to your left inner thigh take a deep breath inhale exhale reach forward and grab your foot chin up inhale exhale further down eyes on the big toe and five breaths you can micro bend your left knee if necessary one more deep breath and relax now bring your right hand down to the back close to the butt lift your hips up off the ground left arm reaching all the way to the back and eyes following the left finger hold five breaths two more deep breaths we're almost there gently drop down and down seated spinal twist instructions first and then we do this together down on the floor legs extended out spine straight now bend your left knee place it on the floor bend your right knee and bring your right foot outside your left knee now use your left arm to grab your right outer thigh as much as you can and drop your right arm down but elbow soft turn all the way back and hold that for five breaths before we do it on the other side are we ready let's do this together position extend your legs out bend your left knee bend your right knee and bring your right foot outside your left knee left arm on your right outer thigh and right arm down on the floor look all the way back and five breaths now here again the focus is on your spine your shoulders your upper back chest and neck keep breathing two more deep breaths and chain sides legs extended out now this side bend your right knee first then your left bring your left foot outside your right knee take your right arm all the way around grab your left outer thigh place your left arm down and eyes back five breaths feel the work on the spine 
shoulders and chest. Two more deep breaths. Last one. And relax. And It's time to cool down. Supine cobbler pose. Instructions first and then we do this together. Lie down on your back. Feet together. Bend your knee. Now let the knees drop down to the side. Don't force it. Let it just drop. Arms overhead. Keep your elbows bent but shoulders touching the ground. Relax. Now five deep breaths. Are we ready? Let's do this together. Inhale and exhale. Feel the stomach expand as you inhale. And sink down as you exhale. Three more deep breaths. Feet together, shoulders on the ground. One last deep breath. Relax. Now bring your knees up. Use your arms to bring your knees together. Arms down, rise up and down. And now it's time for Shavasana. Are we ready? Down on the floor. Lie down. Legs extended out. Now arms down on the ground, away from the body. Relax. You can curl your fingers. Now feet flopping to the side. Take a deep breath. Relax. Close your eyes. Be aware of your breath. Rise up, stay seated, legs folded, palms to the heart center. Now rub your palms, feel the heat and place it on your eye, on your cheeks. And gently open your eyes. Well done. Now remember, awareness of breath will help you engage the right muscle. And that will further help you improve the alignment of the spine. And that's what we achieved with this particular session. Good job there. Take care. See you in session six.